you are practicing main idea again and key details. So if you are at school on Monday, you have a paper that you can use to do this and then just take a picture. Your paper looks exactly like the chart that you have on the screen. So remember that a main idea is what the story is mostly about. And when we have a nonfiction text like this one, we can think to ourselves, what did the author want us to learn? This week, you are actually going to already have the main idea. So as you can see on the chart here, the main idea is Jacques Cousteau loved the sea and wanted to share his love of the sea with others. So your job this time is going to be to find key details in the story that support that main idea, that prove that main idea. So when you go through the story and you find details, the details you select should always point us back to Jacques Cousteau loved the sea and wanted to share his love with others. So we know that Jacques was a weak and sickly boy. That's a detail in the story, but that is not a detail that shows us he loved the sea and wanted to share the love with others. That's a detail just about him. So think about that. Does your detail support the idea that he loved the sea and he wanted to share it with others. Also, you're going to work on the essential meaning. Remember that the essential meaning is asking you, why is this text so important? What could be a worldly message that we could learn from this book? Your essential meaning should not mention Jacques Cousteau because that's a specific detail for this story. So think about what is a big idea that you think you could learn. The, the nonfiction essential meanings are a little harder than the fiction ones like never give up or do your best. So just think and try to come up with what you think makes this text important for the world.